One of the biggest issues in our environment today is we're bombarded with chemicals. Number one, glyphosate. It is everywhere. What is it? I want to teach you about it and then show you how to detox. Let's go. Today we're talking glyphosate. Now, if you've been waking up over the past few years and becoming aware of all the ways that we're slowly being poisoned through our toxic environment, then I know this one has been on your radar. Big thumbs up if it has. We know we're being bombarded by this toxic chemical everywhere we turn. But is it really that dangerous? How are we exposed to it? What does it do in our bodies? And most importantly, well, what I'm fascinated about, how can we get it out of our bodies? In this series, I want to break it down for you all things glyphosate. I want to give you the tools to eat smart, my friend, to detox from it, to heal smart, and take control of your health. Healthcare is self-care. You've heard me say that before. So glyphosate, what is it? Well, it's the most widely used weed killer in agriculture today, used in a product called Roundup, and now there's more extension to this. Every year, more than 300 million pounds of glyphosate are sprayed, and not just GMO crops, but it's used on non-GMO crops like wheats, oats, barley, legumes, chickpeas, and lentils as a desiccant to the speed of drying right before the harvest. We're exposed daily through the foods we eat, the water we drink, and the air that we breathe. Now this is probably why one study showed, and I'll leave these studies below, 93% of us have glyphosate in our urine. Now, it's a problem since the mid-90s, and it's only getting worse. Here are a few harmful effects associated with glyphosate. Number one, the C word, cancer, classified by the World Health Organization as a possible carcinogen in 2015. Now, it's been found to increase cancer risk by 41%, specifically non-Hodgkin lymphoma. Number two, my friend, is it destroys your gut. It disrupts the shikimate pathway, which is found in plants. And while you and I don't have that, the microbes in our gut actually do. The bacteria in our gut does. Now, when these microbes are harmed, it can lead to a deficiency in the thyroid hormone, melatonin at night, serotonin, dopamine, adrenaline, and N B vitamins. It's also a metal chelator, meaning it removes metals and minerals, and your gut microbes need those metals and minerals to survive. Just as much as you are a biological being, you are an electromagnetic being. Every cell has an antenna, and it's sending signals to other cells in the body, and if you don't have your metals, guess what? It's kind of a deficient receiving and giving cell. You know what I'm saying. A damaged microbiome means we've opened the gateway to all kinds of disease and stress, chronic illnesses, diabetes, obesity, arthritis, Alzheimer's, and uh, autism was another one. So, number three, reproductive damage. Now, one study showed it altered the reproductive and developmental effects in both male and female rats at the levels deemed safe in drinking water by the U.S. government. Now, if you've been tracking reproduction over the past 20, 30 years, you will see that there's been a drop-off, number one, in testosterone in men, and also the amount of miscarriage and the birth portal, the miracle designed woman, are actually not as effective and efficient. That is a problem. Number four, potential liver disease, even at extremely low doses. Liver, third brain, super important at detoxification. That gets backed up, you're gonna have some issues. Number five, allergies. It increases the gluten and dairy allergies because of the compromised micro gut biome, leading to autoimmune development and all types of diverse conditions. Number six is it can increase Increase the toxicity of heavy metals. Glyphosate allows aluminum, nano aluminum, to penetrate various parts of the body more easily, meaning that the most prevalent heavy metals in our bodies are overloaded. With this becomes a much more toxic environment, right? The glyphosate causes leaky gut, leaky blood brain barrier, so that the heavy metals are shuttled deep into the body where they actually stick, get stuck, and now your electromagnetic suit's all gummed up. Glyphosate may actually make omega 6s more chronic and toxic in the body adding to pain levels. It can damage our collagen, which collagen, as you know, is great for anti-aging. It hinders your blood's ability to maintain proper viscosity, meaning it's an increased risk of hemorrhaging or clotting, and can cause DNA damage. Your DNA is a miracle as it is. We don't need it tampered with. And guess what? The list goes on. We are slowly being poisoned. So the problem is, or the question is, more importantly, is what can we do about it? You know I'm all about giving you solutions. If you've been following me over the past 11 years at Fit Life TV. So there it is. Number one, well, we've got to eat less of it. It's all over the place. Limit your exposure. Non-GMO, glyphosate residue free. Because you can be following the best detox protocols out there, but still be consuming 
glyphosate over and over and over again. And to break the toxic cycle, first I recommend making friends with local farmers. Get out there to the farmer's market, join the co-op, meet them, make friends with them, make friends with the cows, make friends with the chickens, the alpaca. You know how we do. When you know exactly how your food is grown, you're gonna appreciate the quality that much more plugged into the circle of life. You know what I'm saying. Check out the Weston A. Price Foundation too. Read Weston's book, it's absolutely incredible. Find a local chapter of like-minded people, connect with them, eat clean, real food. Another way is you find local pasture-raised meat and dairy. You can go to eatwild.com. Check that out. You can order your food there. And beyond that, most of us are still getting a lot of our foods from these corporatized grocery stores out there. So avoid conventionally grown foods, especially GMOs, which are now called bioengineered. I am a bioengineered GMO as much as possible because they are loaded with chemicals like glyphosate. But did you know that eating food labeled non-GMO and organic? And I used to say, if it's organic, don't panic, but it doesn't mean that it's glyphosate residue free. In fact, a recent study by the Detox Project, more than half of the foods they tested at the grocery store chains, Whole Foods, Target, these other places, contain glyphosate. Even though it's organic and non-GMO certified organic, it still had glyphosate. In fact, foods labeled non-GMO were some of the most heavily glyphosate contaminated foods on the market. For example, Whole Foods 365 brand whole wheat non-GMO bread was the second highest scoring of glyphosate possible. Are we living in some inverted world or what? So we want to look for certified organic food, which is not allowed to be sprayed with glyphosate. This isn't a guarantee against glyphosate because it's in our rainwater. It's falling from the sky, people. Or it sometimes drifts from a nearby field. Roundup in your face leaves glyphosate residues of the organic produce. The detox project still showed that organic had far lower levels, but guess what? You're not out of the clear, it's still there. So while it's not perfect, eating organic does make a big difference. So for the person out there that's like, organic and conventional, it doesn't matter, there's no difference. Well, if you like glyphosate stuck in your body, now let's talk supplements. I'm the supplement guy, right? Organifi. And I know you guys are super focused on achieving optimum health, and that's why you're here with me, and or most of us, means that we're dialed in on our supplements. We've got our superfood smoothies, our juices, our vitamins, our herbs, our Chinese mushrooms, protein shakes, all kinds of other stuff to support detoxification and get those nutrients, right? But what if those pills, powders, and potions, or whatever you're consuming are full of, should I even say it? Glyphosate. You want your supplements to be not only certified, but also you want the label to say glyphosate residue free certified. This is the most important thing I think right now. It's no longer organic's good enough. Glyphosate residue free means that the final product tested independent third party lab, which doesn't happen to be USDA organic. It also means much, much lower glyphosate residue limits. Like we're talking a lot lower. For example, with USDA organic sugarcane, you might get 1500 parts per billion, but with glyphosate residue free, you might only get 10 parts per billion. <laughs> Which one would you rather have? Night and day difference. And this is why Organifi, where we're bringing the world's best superfood and adaptogenic blends, we don't stop at non-GMO certified organic. We went above and beyond to bring you glyphosate residue free certified organic supplements. Every single one of our products goes through rigorous testing of the finished product to make sure that there's no heavy metals, chemical pesticides, synthetic herbicides, fungicides, gluten, pathogens, and yet Yes, we especially test for glyphosate. Now this means you're getting the cleanest supplements possible. So you could pick up a jar of Organifi and this label right here, glyphosate residue free. If that's not on the label, I wouldn't even consume it. So while you're cleaning up your diet to get the glyphosate out, don't forget to include your supplements. And if you're looking for Organifi, you can check it out, Organifi.com. I'll leave a link right there. So let's recap. Glyphosate is absolutely everywhere. It's toxic and it's destroying our health. But there are things we can do. There is hope, my friend. The first step, remove it. Get it out of your diet. Focus on food. Buy local, buy organic. Go to the local farmers. Maybe a co-op, the farmer's market. Look for glyphosate residue free certification in your food supplements. And you can check out the Detox Project's website for a list of companies like Organifi that are truly going above and beyond. If you're looking for the best superfoods out there to support detoxification, boost your immune system, heal your gut, and help you feel better, Organifi has covered this with the highest quality glyphosate residue free supplements. In my next video, I'm going to give you ways that you can detox your body and the people that you love. You like that? Big thumbs up. Smash that like button. Whatever you learned in this video too, leave it in the comments below.
hello. I'm Drew Canoli, and as always, remember, we're in this together, and I'll see you soon.